This is amazing. Now we have Autogen user interface where you can create group chat using the user interface. You are able to create agents, add skills to those agents and also make it work together. That's exactly what we're going to see today. Let's get started. Hi everyone, I'm really excited to show you about Autogen Studio. In this, we are going to create AI travel agents, which can create events, find the budget, find the package items, and prepare a seven day trip for you. In this, we have a travel agent manager, a city selection expert, and a local agent. They are working together in Autogen user interface to prepare a travel plan for us. I'm going to take you through step by step on how to do this. But before that, I regularly create videos in regards to artificial intelligence on my YouTube channel. So do subscribe and click the bell icon to stay tuned. Make sure you click the like button so this video can be helpful for many others like you. To set up Autogen Studio UI, first Conda create hyphen and Autogen Studio Python equals 3.11 and then click enter. Next, Conda activate Autogen Studio and then click enter. Now pip install Autogen Studio and then click enter. For our purpose, we are going to install DuckDuckGo search using pip install. This is used for searching the internet. First, we are going to create agents and then add the skills. DuckDuckGo search is a skill which we are going to add to those agents so they can search relevant latest information. And thirdly, we are going to make them work together using an Autogen group. In your terminal, type Autogen Studio UI hyphen port 8081 and then click enter. This will automatically start your user interface. And here is the URL which you can navigate to to open your user interface. I'm going to click that. And here is the beautiful interface. Now we are going to click the build button at the top. There first we are going to add skills. I'm going to add new skill. Here I'm going to enter a search internet skill. This is using DuckDuckGo search and then it's going to retrieve the results. I'm going to save the skill name as search internet. And then I'm going to click the OK button. Now the skill got saved. Now I'm going to create agents. We're going to create three agents. The first one is a travel agent manager. In this, I'm going to make it maximum replies 30. You can define your own. Just to make my tutorial quicker, I'm going to increase this to 30. Human input never. I'm adding a system message where this agent is going to talk to the city expert agent and then the local agent. And it's going to prepare a seven day travel itinerary. This includes weather forecasts, packaging suggestion and the budget breakdown. I'm going to use GPT-4 model and then I'm going to click OK. Now the agent got created. I'm going to add two more agents. City selection expert agent. City selection expert. Max auto reply is 30. I'm going to give a system message for the city expert agent. It is going to use the search tool and then find the weather patterns, seasonal events and other information. I'm going to add a skill called search internet. Add skill. This is the one which we created earlier. I think we forgot to add the search skill for the travel agent manager. So I'm going to go there, add skill and add the search internet skill and then click OK. Now I'm going to add the third agent, local agent, local agent, max reply 30. And I've added the system message. This agent is going to provide an in-depth guide for someone traveling there and wanting the best trip ever. Gather information about key attractions, local customs, special events and daily activity recommendation using search internet skill. I'm going to add the skill again, search internet and click the add skill button and then click OK. Now we've added three agents with skills added. Next, we are going to create workflows. That's where you make those agents work together. So going to click new workflow and then group chat. There I'm going to mention the workflow name as AI agents, AI agents as description and summary method last user proxy. I'm going to give that as a maximum number of replies is 30 and then click OK. Now going to the receiver there. I'm going to enter group chat manager. He's going to manage the whole group there. I'm going to give the maximum auto reply as 30 and then going to add skills, search internet skill and then click OK. At the top, I need to add three agents, travel agent manager, city selection expert and then local agent. Now all agents are added in this group. Finally, I'm going to click OK. Workflow created successfully. Now, finally, we are ready to use those agents and create a task. So in the playground tab, click new session, choose AI agents from the drop down and click create. Now going to ask a question, trip planning to London, Feb 2024 and then click enter. Now the agents are working behind the screen and here you can see the backend. 
where the task is being sent to the group chat manager. I can see the city selection expert is going to perform three tasks, find the weather patterns, seasonal events, and find the travel costs using DuckDuckGo search. It searched for weather in London in February 2024 and got some information. Again, it's going to search London events in February 2024. It is searching for the things to do in London and also how much does it cost to visit London in 2024. Here is the final output from Travel Agent Manager. Great, we have gathered some valuable information for your trip to London in February 2024. Here is a summary and it gave the seasonal events in London, travel costs, 7-day London itinerary, day 1 arrival to London, day 2 sightseeing and romantic vibes, day 3 fashion and culture, day 4 day 5 day 6 leisure and high tea, day 7 departure. It is giving the weather consideration, budget breakdown and total estimated cost. This is really exciting. It is able to work together to prepare this and give it to us. How much time this will take if a real person is doing this? manually. All this thing took approximately a minute. One important thing to note about this Autogen user interface is that I was able to do only maximum number of nine times. So the output which you saw here is probably the 10th or 11th message. So in the user interface, I was able to see only the ninth message. After ninth, it's not displaying. Maybe it'll be fixed soon because as you know, this is a beta version. Similarly, in regards to skills, we added the DuckDuckGo search skill, but here I can see it is trying to use that skill, but it's failing. Then it automatically generated the own code to run it. Maybe still they are working to fix this error. So probably when you are going to try after like a week or two, this issue won't be there. That's it, as simple as that. Now you are able to generate the travel tips, travel planning in a fly using AI agents. I'm going to create more videos similar to this, so stay tuned. I hope you like this video. Do like, share and subscribe and thanks for watching.